At Hall Center, we are developing uh, new fluidic sensors that can determine certain compounds in fluid. For instance, uh, the acidity level, pH, but also minerals, for instance, sodium, potassium, and chloride. These are all important parameters for certain applications, for instance, water quality in agriculture, but also in, in, in medical applications. You would like to know, for instance, the, uh, comp the, the, the ionic composition of certain bodily fluids like urine or uh, sweat. So we have developed an all solid state sensor. This means that there's only a single chip having multiple electrodes on this chip which are each sensitive to a different compound in the fluid. And we achieve this by uh, having multiple uh, materials on this chip which we modify such that they are solely sensitive to one compound in solutions. And by having multiple electrodes we can make a multi-ion sensor which means that it can detect multiple ions uh, uh, simultaneously. Uh, here we demonstrate pH, which is the acidity level. And acidity level is uh, determined in many applications, ranging from uh, swimming pools uh, to, to medical applications and to agriculture, for instance. The whole system, the sensor is read out by this small in-house developed um, uh, readout board. The sensor itself is connected to this board and then wirelessly read out by, uh, by the computer. And that only the tip of the sensor needs to be immersed in certain fluids. And here we demonstrate, for instance, uh, the, 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 the acidity level of certain perishables like milk, orange juice, vinegar, ranging from coke. As a demonstration, this is now a calibrated sensor which I immerse now in milk and milk is neutral as you can also see which has a, 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 is, uh, has a pH around 7 so the, here it's, it is slightly, slightly acidic in contrast when I for instance immerse the sensor in, in coke in, or in any fizzy drink this, this fluid is quite acidic, having a pH of only 2.8. It also demonstrates uh, the fast response time of the sensor. You only need to, you have to rinse it, and now I immerse it in, in orange juice, and already within a few seconds it, it has its final uh, pH value.